Now, for a voltage divider circuit, I said that I've got two sets of equations. One set of equation is for a stiff circuit, which makes it easier to do calculations, or a not so stiff circuit where I've got complicated equations. So, if I could take you to Appendix 1. Go to Appendix 1. In Appendix 1, we see a table and at the top is cutoff and saturation. And what's the next thing? The table on the left is stiff circuit. And on the right is not so stiff circuit, okay? Stiff circuit is where I2 is greater than 10 times IB. So this curve here, I2 is greater than 10 times IB. So that's how we define a stiff circuit. So let's do a stiffness test. Um, and so I use those equations that are shown uh, on the left side if my circuit is stiff. So we're gonna do the stiffness test first and uh, then calculate VB, VE, IC, VC, and VCE. Okay, in that order. So, let's go back to page seven. Page seven, everyone. B, HF stiffness test. HFE times RE, is it greater than 10 times R2? That's the stiffness test. We looked at this test in notes 12. If you go back to your notes 12, we did this test for stiffness. So, HFE for this circuit is given to be how much? 175. RE is 100 plus 2.1K. Is that greater than 10 times R2 is how much? 20K? So what's the uh, answer on the left side? What's the answer on the right side? 385K here. 200K here. Is, is 385K greater than 200K? Yes. Circuit is stiff. Use stiff equations. Make sense? So on test number three, when you're when you're going to come prepared with your crib sheet for test number three, you're going to have those equations on your crib sheet which appear in appendix one, right? For stiff for stiff circuit, and let me give you a little hint. We're, we're not going to be working with not stiff circuits this semester, okay? We're only going to be working with stiff circuits, uh, stiff circuit. So then, that's my, so I use now VB, VE, IC, IE, and uh, VCE to, to determine the Q point. So what's the point of doing all this? To find the Q point. And to find the Q point, which is somewhere here, on the load line, I have to do these three or four calculations. The first calculation is VD. So that's R2 over R1 plus R2 times what? VCC. That's VB. Where's VB? Right here. Notice that I'm doing VC analysis, so I'm going to use all uppercase. Uppercase B, uppercase C, uppercase E. So R2 is 20K over R1. How much is R1? 150K. Plus 20K. Multiplied by 15. What do you get? Twenty-five 
120 over 170 times 15. How much? Okay, so that's ID. 